Value Chain Development Program has flagged off the distribution of production and processing equipment worth 80 million naira to farmers across eight local government councils in Niger State. The national coordinator of the program said the goal is to boost rice and agriculture production to mitigate food shortage. Chenemi Bamiyi reports. Agriculture is one sector that was greatly hit by the floods that swept through 21 local government councils in Niger State. The state is one of the largest producers of rice in Nigeria. Local reports by the state emergency agency says that over 8,000 farmlands and houses were lost. The federal government of Nigeria, through the Value Chain Development Program, assisted by the International Fund for Agriculture Development, is providing production and processing equipment to some farmers in eight local government councils in Niger State. This is to support rice and cassava production the implements include knapsack sprayers, treasures, power tillers, rice distoners, wind balance, and communal fryers. The Niger State Governor is represented by his deputy, Abed Ketso, at the flag off of the distribution exercise. It's very clear. I want them to make judicial use of this and also to add value to the economic value chain of their various local government, of course, the state at large, and also to show more commitment to ensure the productivity of whatever they are producing. Anyway, to make sure that they utilize them efficiently because it's for their own good. It is for their own good to improve their own livelihood, to improve, to enhance their own food security and also improve their standards of living. We are already on top of the post-flood effect uh, by way of uh, sensitizing our farmers to make sure they partake in the dry season farming. Some physically challenged persons were provided grinding machines to contribute to the chain. Rabia to Danyaro is blind and one of the beneficiaries. By getting this grinding machine, I'll be able to buy soap and food for myself and take care of my family. Free soap, comfortable and very good. And uh, this grinding machine, I will use it to feed my family. Uh, the program director disclosed that the implements cost about 80 million naira and the benefiting farmers are paying only 30% of the cost. Dry season farming is the next available option to cushion the effects that this flood has had on agriculture. With these implements, the farmers are able to go back to farm when the water recedes and continue the agricultural production to avoid food shortage in the coming year. Chenemi Bamiyi, TVC News, Mina.